This is a significant and an exciting milestone in the building of the Gullwing Bridge. People can now start to see the bridge really beginning to take shape. A structure which once finished will have a huge and positive impact on the town of Lowestoft and the wider area. So Nav 1 is about 20 metres wide, 60 metres long. It weighs nearly 1,500 tonnes. It's the first section of the bridge that we're going to install. It spans between Pier 7 and the north abutment uh, on the northern end of the bridge. Planning this uh, move for over two years since tendering for the job back in 2020. Since then, we've been working closely with Network Rail, all our temporary works designers, the permanent works designer, uh, and all our specialist subcontractors to develop a plan for this installation. The bridge has been designed as steel girders with a reinforced concrete deck and the steel acts compositely with that concrete. Um, and this solution was chosen because it gives you the right balance between structural efficiency, uh, low carbon impact, cost benefits and in this instance minimum disruption to the railway. The project management team from the council have been working collaboratively with the contractor and with all of the other subcontractors that are on site for this move. Um, just making sure each is aware of the scope, the areas they'll be working, the areas they'll be responsible for, just making sure everything is well coordinated. This is a much needed bridge because it will open up investment to the town by tackling congestion and improving connectivity for motorists, for cyclists and for pedestrians. By making lower stock easier to move around, existing businesses should benefit from an increase in trade and new businesses should also be attracted to the area.